Well today we have the leadership speeches from some amazing students in Year 11 who are exceptional leaders already, um, but they're vying for positions in the school's leadership team. You've put yourself out there and you've shown everyone what you're really made of and I'm really proud of that and you should be proud of that. My name is Angus Cave. My name is Claire Hawley. My name is David Thomas. What made me decide to go for a leadership role was simply to um, get the students' voices heard. I had previous experience as of this year for the uh, Year 7 2023 peer support, making a variety of new friendships with the uh, student body. I think I went alright. Um, I was a bit nervous at the start, but I eased into it, so I was pretty right as I eased into it. What made me decide to go for a leadership role was looking at all the past leaders in the school and being able to look up to them. It was very inspiring. I think it's important to have leaders in a school because it's someone who can represent the students and someone that the students can look up to. Oh, I think I went pretty well. It was pretty nerve-wracking, but yeah. I think I handled it well. It's important to me to show to my parents I am an SRC member and I am house captain for Blackson. It is important to have leaders in a school to just have a path that they can follow uh, so people can look up to them, so it's structured. I think it was pretty good getting yep. in the motion, but yeah, I think it went pretty good. Extremely important to have leaders at school. I think everyone should have someone they should look up to and be influenced by. It's important to me because I really like to be organised, leading by example, and I really want to make sure that everyone feels that they belong at school. I think it went all right. It was much better than I thought it would be. Yep. But yeah, once I got up there, it just went so much, so well. I'm absolutely blown away with the quality and the mindset of these kids. They absolutely love school and they talk about school spirit and I've never seen anything like it. I'm extremely proud to have these kids leading our school. I'm really proud of how I went. Uh, I think I, I had a bunch of plans and then I kind of improv everything, but I'm hoping that the students can sort of see what I was trying to get at and vote for me. I love every moment of being a leader and that also pushed me to go for this role. I think it's really important for younger students to look up to me and for me to help guide them through school. Yeah, it's definitely one of the most stressful things I've ever done, but I'm proud of myself and I'm happy that I did it. I feel like what made me decide to go for a leadership position was just the sense that leaders can instill a sense of pride amongst the students. Being able to encourage both myself to you know, get out there a bit more and encourage other students is really important. It's really about building my confidence skills and showing that it doesn't really matter where you come from, Every leader has the same qualities and all, and it's just how you use them. It's a lot of kids. Yeah. Um, it's very daunting, but I feel like once I got out there, it just all the fears went away. There's a big responsibility that comes with leadership. But leaders do need to stand at the front. Leaders need to make hard decisions so that everyone wins and everybody gets something out of school. So the 2024 20, male school captain of Bathurst High Campus is Anthony Driver. Kai Clary. The 2024 female captain of Bathurst High Campus is Shalice Catamal. The vice captain female for 2024 is Chloe Press. It's time to stand up and it's time to lead and show some really strong leadership. But thank you again everyone and thank you for waiting until this time of the afternoon.